I would describe myself as funny, genuine, and stubborn. None of my fans know that I used to ride BMX when I was younger and I was fifth in the nation, which was pretty cool. A skincare step that I can't live without is probably chemical exfoliation because it leaves my skin bright and glowy. Being able to nap is very hard nowadays, so when I get the chance, I do like to nap. My favorite Clear Start product is probably the Flash Foliant because, like I said before, I love chemical exfoliation and you just leave it on. It's super easy to use. What I love most about TikTok is probably the collaborations I get to do with so many new people I've met, old friends, new friends, my sister. My least favorite thing about TikTok is probably the comment section sometimes because there are a lot of hate comments, but there also are a lot of good comments, so it's 50-50 sometimes. My go-to daytime outfit is probably jeans and a crop top. Yeah. <laughs> Also probably jeans and a crop top for a date night. Um, maybe a little nicer pair of jeans and crop top. But... I love how Clear Star is so accepting about all skin types and is very open about acne and doesn't try to hide that it's actually there and it happens and people need to know that no one's perfect. Uh, some advice for uh, people who are trying to get noticed on TikTok is definitely be yourself, be natural, and have fun because that's what people like to see. You don't need to overdo it. You don't need to wear a full face of makeup. People like to see you natural in a messy room. In five years, I hope to have started my own business and maybe be working in New York City. Definitely coffee. If I had to choose between no makeup and full glam, I'm pretty 50-50 because sometimes I'm in the mood for no makeup and then sometimes I like being all fancied up. I would love to be able to have loose waves, but I usually just go with the messy bun because my hair gets really frizzy. My favorite person to follow on TikTok is my sister. My favorite person to follow on Instagram is one of my fan accounts and it's called Dixie D'Amelio's Closet and they post all my clothes and sometimes they hype me up too much and put really expensive clothes when it's just not from anywhere expensive. The important thing is to stay calm if you're breaking out before a big shoot. Uh, I apply my breakout clearing booster and just know it happens to everyone and it's part of life and you have to deal with it sometimes. To me, skin acceptance means embracing real skin, freckles, acne, all of it, because it happens to everyone. One thing I want to say to my fans is just how thankful I am, everyone who supports me and follows my journey and my crazy life. 